Okay, I've changed to night seed now. I thought, okay, we'll turn around here, same sign, same everything, going up the same hill, just at the shot we've just seen before. So, if there is any difference, you should be able to see it now. But, uh, see, that was a vista down there. I don't think I quite caught it. Here comes the car. straight on here is it uh, last week <clears throat> I think it was Monday actually this week I turned right down there down Grant's Gully Road and then into Piggy Range now I'm going past Sugarloaf Road past the um, the Christmas tree farm on the left taking a detour to see if I can get a much better over, you know, that overview shot of the Cherry Garden substation. The, um, the Christmas tree far farm from the other side and I think we've got some awesome light here I just don't know whether I've uh, cooked my chickens by turning over the night scene rather than AV in the car but I suppose we'll find out when we get home Sun in January, there's something. Now, if I turn in here and do it properly, I might be able to get it. Let's go in here. Might be able to go up this road, park the car sideways, and get a good, uh, somehow get a good screenshot of the substation from this angle which is what I wanted to do the other day but the fence was in the way I tried. Uh, at least you get a, a vista out there, I suppose. Uh, oh no, hang on. Might be able to do it. Let's, let's, let's have a go. I'll have to do a 60 billion point turn, but you never know. Again, we've got railings in the way, but it would have been nice if the gate was open. It would I could probably go out there and get a good one. But anyway, 
it was it was worth a try. I thought. Yeah, a sixty billion point turn. I think that's what it's going to be. Hopefully old Lloyd Lindholm, my driving instructor, is having a bit of a chuckle. Although he might be in the old folks home right now. It was in the 90s, I was doing <laughs> driving lessons. Too long otherwise as I said uh, 8 to 12 maybe 15 minutes max you know a 15 minute clip takes me all midnight to early hours of the morning sort of top upload so yeah yeah I've got to find Potter Road so remind me to look out for that because if I take the wrong road I'll end up going down to Clarendon This footage with the footage from the, um, a week, I think it's exactly a week ago, like uh, last Friday. It was Friday today. I did um, Pickett Range Road Monday this week, but last Friday I think I was out at uh, doing this. So, um, I don't think I'll pull in there because the gate's in the way, unfortunately. I've got someone, someone with a fat ass behind me who wants to go many miles an hour on this sort of road. Yeah, don't make me do that, mate. bloody well like it mate so stop doing it stop forcing me to go there we go potter road hopefully we'll get a good screenshot of that Wrecky down there. I think I have been there once before, but uh, somewhere in here to the right. Yeah, to Butt Road. You 
you might want to take a pre recce on Google uh, newspaper view sort of thing and just to get you self familiarised with the area. Oh, the wood piles are still here, <laughs> getting ready for uh, coming soon. As, as I said, it seems to be coming early. I mean, it's bright, sunny, mm, warmish, but there was um, thick dew on the car this morning. And the one took my son out at 10.30, so you know, the season is, seems, uh, seems to be um, changing early. So uh, hopefully it might uh, turn out to be a, um, a flip year. housing on that thing of theirs now fade into a, a respectable ink <laughs> rather than a shocking magenta so yeah well, there you go I like the turquoise one though yeah. I don't know why they have the two colours there must be a reason for it surely you, you, know, you just don't go and buy you know 50 million gallons of shocking pink for no apparent reason you know for female builders, I don't know. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. turn the car around and get a screenshot out of that oh well it was worth a try but we're on wide angles so it probably looked like a million miles away but uh, I do try <laughs> yes you're very trying Richard <laughs> Yeah, the, um, the, the, uh, the CPN turned up, the ICPS CPN, the Cannabis Plant Newsletter turned up yesterday with uh, the late, great uh, Jeff Wong on the back. I got confused for, for a few months and thought it was that. Leo Song was second and I'm thinking, did Leo Song die last year or? I can't remember now, I'm going to have to look that up. I mean, there have been so many deaths recently. I mean, next it'll be Joe Mesremus and, um, God forbid, Donald Schnell. I mean, you might, it's almost worth just having a conference to celebrate um, Joe Mesremus and Donald Schnell together sort of thing. I, I, reckon. I mean, why can't we have a conference while they're still alive? I mean, <laughs> wouldn't that be better? Yes. Awesome sunnage. Now one of my first clips to YouTube is coming through here uh, in 2011 I think it was, so you know. Geez, three years ago I started putting up clips. And I've still got stuff from other years and I've all got a whole box of hopefully a micro cassettes from, from the Donny era going back uh, to the early 2000s all our other trips out to the conservation parks some of which I'll be returning to today and I'll even be going to new ones this year so uh, yeah so it's been a bit of a burnout here so I've got to try and find my bearings there's some little pathway I've got to ascertain and walk in there and then find the track I've got to start off on so you know it might be a bit of a bit harem scaring trying to find the damn place a little way down from the uh, it might be that one I'm not 
not sure. It's not quite as far up as the substation, so it could be some.